Papua New Guinea, The Groka Show by Elise, Abby, Morgan, and Emma. It started in 1957 at the Independence Park, opposite from the Gorka, a main market. The Gorka Show is probably the most popular known tribal gathering in Papua New Guinea. About 100 tribes arrived to show their music, dance, and culture. The Gorka Show attracts tourists all over the world. It is held every year around Independence Day. It was introduced and organized by Australian Kayaks. Kayaks from each district to build roundhouses. The Gorka Show is also a competition to see which district is the most organized. Each one of them representing their district would build roundhouses typical in Gorka Show ground, properly displayed cultures of their districts. These days, the Gorka Show is partly a tourist event, but it's a rare opportunity for travelers to experience for the customs of over 100 tribes that populate the Papua New Guinea and Highlands. This show takes place closest to Independence Day on even years only. The spin-offs to people and business houses in the province is appreciated. The show provides entertainment to the people of the Eastern Highlands and to visitors from PNG and overseas. The costumes that they wear is a tradition to their culture. Almost all of their traditional costumes are made of the bird of paradise, which is one of the main symbols there. This bird can also be seen on the flag of Papua New Guinea. This flower is named after the bird of paradise. This is the flag of Papua New Guinea. On the red half, there is a bird of paradise. On the black part, there are five stars representing the Southern Cross. And lastly, yellow, black, and red are their traditional colors.